It was the time of 879 AD when King Radhadev was ruling the city of Kantapur and Patan, while King Anandadev was ruling the Bhaktapur in the valley of Nepal Mandal, and the states were suffering from a long drought with no time to rainfall, and the people were dying of hunger and diseases. In the palace of Bhaktapur, King Anandadev is meeting with his royal advisor to tackle the deplorable condition of the country due to drought, poverty, and diseases. Advisor, it is very sad that we could not improve the situation of this country. Are you thinking of any solutions or just shaking your head? Yes, Maharaj. I've done everything in my capacity, but until there is rain or some miracle, it is looking very difficult to make things better. Huh, a miracle. And how are you planning to make this miracle happen? Er, I have informed the situation to our Raj Purit and requested for a plan to help us out. Our only hope is if he is able to come up with something. In the other end, Raj Purit is researching on mighty Vedic mantras and rituals through his knowledge and experience in astrology to generate wealth for the country. Pranam Maharaj. Pranam. Maharaj, if you give me permission, I would like to present my idea of turning sand into grains of pure gold. Oh, this is very exciting. We were just talking about the miracle. Raj Parade. It has to be the first three buckets collected early in the morning, which should be stored in a dark corner covered with a white cloth. Overnight, after my chanting of Vedic mantras along with the ritual ceremony, we will all see golden sand the next morning. But this junction is in Kantipur, and Raghav Dev rules there. And I don't want this information leaked to anyone. What should we do? Do not worry, Maharaj. I will arrange workers who can bring the sand and make sure they don't talk about it. Okay, you summon the workers so they go to Kantipur tonight and collect the three buckets of sand. Rajpur, please make arrangements for your mission. Yes, Maharaj. Come here, workers. Listen to me carefully. It is King Anandadev's order for you. Go to Lakhi Tirtha and Kantipur early in the morning of tomorrow and bring three buckets of sand. Keep the bucket safe at the corner on the side of the dark room in the palace by tomorrow. And make sure that you do not tell anyone that this is the royal order. Do you understand? Oh, in the early morning from Kantipur? Can't we bring it from our nearby river? There's enough sand there too. Did you not hear what I said? You must bring the sand from Lakhupurtha, not from anywhere else. Is it two buckets enough? He is totally useless and always drinks. The king needs three buckets of sand. Do you understand? And I am commanding you not to drink and do the job as you are told, okay? Oh, oh, yes, yes. Who said I am drunk? I am not drunk. Hmm. We knew I have to drink a little during the beehive, isn't it? No, no drinking at all. Just bring the sand to so all get punished. Yes, sir. As you said, we will bring the sand from Lakhadita by tomorrow. You know, Pasa, I wonder why the king wants sand from Gaikabur rather than from our city. I just don't get it. What do you think, Pasa? I don't know, Pasa, but it's royal orders, so we have to carry them out no matter what we think. Maybe the river is more sacred and famous. Why would the king care? He's not carrying any sand. You girls are. Do as the advisor says, okay? You were supposed to help us carry the sand back into the to put you silly drunk. You do as we say. In this early morning, who are these people? What are they doing? They don't think they are needed to come to good. Hey, what are you doing? Why are you collecting sand from here? Are you selling them in the market? No, no. 
We're just taking this insane home. We need it for some reason. Well, it's none of your business, mister. Please do your puja and let us do our work. Hmm. I can tell you all are not from Katipur, and I thought to ask because you all look tired and hungry too. What a nice man. You know, I think Ananda Dev of Katipur, he wants that from Raghudita. God knows why. In Malpata, we should instead be drinking and having fun. By the way, do you have some Ela? Mine is almost finished. Don't you remember what the royal advisor was told us not to tell anyone? Tell anyone? Why on earth would a king from Bhaktapur want sand from the river in Gantipuri? There must be something fishy here. I will also have to take the sand to investigate. Look, I also need some sand for my construction. I have been looking for workers to collect sand, but because it is Tihar, all workers here are busy. If you help me, I will give you good breakfast and some golden coins and some ela too. My house is not far, so you can collect another batch of sand for the king and return back to the palace. What? Gold coins? Ela? Ah, oh, perfect. I told you guys. He's such a nice man. Oh, I will definitely carry sands for you, Mister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you drunk. Let me think. I'm hungry and tired too. We have enough time to take the sands to the king as well. What do you say, Vasa? Okay, Mister. We will bring you some sand to your home until breakfast. We are hungry and will need the energy to carry the baskets of sand back to the palace. But no ale for this guy, not a drop. But it is Mamuza. No ill like Mamuza. That's ridiculous. Good. Thanks for accepting my proposal. Please forgive us, because 
this drunk. He told the merchant he died to worry about your order. We have told you, sir, this drunk is so useless. Do not punish us for his wrongdoing. Oh, yeah. Only oh, me. And who wants a breakfast and go to the bone to each other like that? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Take them away from my place, soldier. Go to Tantipur and bring me this merchant in Shantatara. Yes, Maharaj. Oh, yes. Yes, Maharaj. Oh my god, what a miracle! A pile of sand trees and fine grains of precious gold. This is an absolute miracle! That's the reason why the king wanted to stand from our sacred river so early in the morning. What should I do now? I don't need all this gold for myself. Our country is on the verge of collapse due to lack of resources. So I think it will be better if I donate these riches to the people suffering from death, hunger, and diseases. But how should I do it? Shantidhar, you are summoned by the king of Bhaktapur. Please get ready to be in the palace as soon as possible. For what reason the king wants to meet with me? I think it must be the goal. I don't know, but you have to come with me immediately to the palace. In your honor, we will create a new era in the name of the country. Thank you, Maharaj, for your kind honor. Advisor, make an announcement that from today, people in the country will be free from their death. From today, the country will be introduced to a new Nepal Samudra calendar to honor Shankadar Sakhar for his generosity. Please make an arrangement to erect the statue of Shankadar in the southern corner of Pashupati Temple in the line with statues of the other kings. Please ask that all citizens come down to and join the national event to mark the beginning of a new Nepal era, Nepal Sangha.
आयली दखा अभी रजतकर ओझा श्रेष्ठा अमान श्रेष्ठा समृद्धि श्रेष्ठा पीसा श्रेष्ठा अनि अयुषा मैनाली एंड रुद्रेश श्रेष्ठा वी वुड आल्सो लाइक टू गिव अ स्पेशल थैंक्स टू द डायरेक्टर दीपेश श्रेष्ठा फॉर कोऑर्डिनेटिंग एंड आल्सो रेडर अलोंग साइड ऑफ द एंटायर कास्टिंग